Did you know that there are seven distinct stages of artificial intelligence? In a world where technology is becoming increasingly important, understanding where we are on the journey to AI can be invaluable. In this video, we will do our best to break down each stage with an easy to understand explanation. To begin, let's start with the first stage. Stage one, rule-based AI systems. Rule-based AI systems, also known as one task systems, represent the earliest stage of artificial intelligence. These systems operate based on a predefined set of rules or an algorithm given to them by programmers. To understand this, imagine playing a game of chess against a computer. The computer knows all possible moves and outcomes based on its coded rules. It can decide the best move based on these rules, but it cannot learn or adapt beyond them. These systems are excellent for tasks with clear-cut rules, like diagnosing a mechanical problem or processing tax forms. They're reliable and consistent, but their intelligence is firmly limited. They lack the ability to learn or understand context. Their decisions are based solely on the rules provided, and they cannot handle scenarios that were not pre-programmed. Stage 2. Context Awareness and Retention Systems Moving a step beyond rule-based AI systems, we arrive at context awareness and retention systems. This stage represents a significant evolution in artificial intelligence. These AI systems are capable of understanding and retaining context, meaning they can remember previous interactions and use that knowledge to inform future responses. A great example of this is your smartphone assistant like Siri or Google Assistant. They not only process and execute commands, but they also learn from your past interactions. If you ask, who won the soccer game yesterday? And then ask, when is their next match? The system understands that their refers to the soccer team from your previous question. This represents a leap from the rule-based AI systems as these systems understand context, retain information, and can handle a much broader set of interactions. Another example is the famous ChatGPT, a system trained on millions of past conversations it can generate automatic human-like responses to any conversation. This context awareness and retention ability allows these AI systems to provide a more personalized and sophisticated user experience. They're like teenagers in the AI development stages. They're not quite independent thinkers yet, but they've learned to remember and use context in their interactions. Stage 3. Domain-Specific Mastery Systems Moving a step beyond context-aware AI, we come to domain-specific mastery systems. This stage represents the AI's ability to not only comprehend and retain information, but to become highly skilled within a particular domain or field. Domain-specific mastery AI can be found in a variety of specialized applications. These systems are not generalists. They're experts, fine-tuned to excel in a specific area. A perfect example of this is IBM's Watson, which was designed to excel at answering questions on the quiz show Jeopardy. Another instance is Google's DeepMind AlphaGo, which was trained specifically to master the complex board game Go, a task it accomplished to the point of defeating world champions. These systems have a deeper understanding of their particular domain than any human could hope to achieve. They can analyze vast amounts of data, identify patterns, and make informed decisions or predictions, all at lightning speed. Domain-specific mastery systems represent the adult stage in AI's growth, demonstrating sophisticated abilities within their specialized fields. But as advanced as they are, they're still far from achieving the dream of true artificial general intelligence. Stage 4. Thinking and Reasoning AI Systems As we cross the threshold into Stage 4, we start to see AI systems that begin to mimic the human capacity for thinking and reasoning. Unlike the previous stages, these AI systems don't just follow rules or retain context. They attempt to simulate the human thought process. Thinking and reasoning AI systems can understand complex concepts, solve unfamiliar problems, and even generate creative ideas. This is made possible by techniques like machine learning and deep learning, which allow the AI to learn from experience and improve its performance over time. For instance, such an AI system could read a book, understand the plot, and even infer the motives of characters based on their actions. Or it could analyze economic data, anticipate market trends, and suggest investment strategies. At this stage, 
AI starts to resemble human intelligence in a more profound way. But it's still not equivalent to a human mind. It's more like a highly advanced tool, specialized in reasoning and thinking tasks. And as fascinating as these AI systems are, we're still only at the halfway point. The upcoming stages venture into the realm of science fiction, with AI matching and even surpassing human intelligence. Stage 5. The Birth of a New Mind Artificial General Intelligence AGI. As we step into the realm of artificial general intelligence, we're entering a world of AI that, for now, remains largely theoretical. AGI, also known as Strong AI, refers to a type of artificial intelligence that equals human intelligence in all aspects. An AGI system would be capable of understanding, learning, adapting, and implementing knowledge across a wide range of tasks. It wouldn't just excel in one domain, like the AI systems of Stage 3, or even just exhibit human-like reasoning, like Stage 4. AGI would effectively be able to perform any intellectual task a human being can. If you asked an AGI to learn a new language, write a symphony, derive a complex mathematical theorem, or even understand human emotions, it should theoretically be able to do it. It would possess self-awareness, consciousness, and the ability to understand and navigate the world just as a human would. However, as of now, AGI remains a concept and has not been achieved yet. It's the frontier of AI research, and it's also where things start to get controversial. Because what happens when AI matches human intelligence? What comes next? Well, let's find out. Stage 6. Artificial Superintelligence, ASI. If you thought the previous stages were intimidating, you ain't seen nothing yet. Enter Artificial Superintelligence, or ASI. This is a level of artificial intelligence where things get really complicated, to the point where it's difficult to define what AI is and isn't, due to the fact that an ASI system would possess cognitive skills far surpassing our own. The concept of ASI is a world where AI can outperform humans in most economically valuable work. It's not just about being able to do everything a human can do, but doing it better, faster, and more efficiently. To understand the level of intelligence of an ASI system, imagine a human being the size of an ant in comparison. An ASI could potentially solve problems that humans can't, coming up with solutions to complex global issues like climate change or disease. It could innovate and create in ways we can't even imagine. It could provide insights into the mysteries of the universe that are currently beyond our understanding. However, the advent of ASI also brings with it a host of ethical and safety concerns. The potential for misuse is enormous, and the risk of unintended consequences is equally significant. It raises fundamental questions about power, control, and the very nature of intelligence and consciousness. The prospect of ASI takes us into the realm of the unknown. And it's here that we encounter the final stage of our journey. Stage 7. The AI Singularity. The AI Singularity, often simply called the Singularity, is a hypothetical future point in time when technological growth becomes uncontrollable and irreversible, leading to unforeseeable changes to human civilization. This is primarily associated with the advent of artificial superintelligence, ASI. The term singularity in this context was popularized by the futurist Ray Kurzweil. It's drawn from physics, where the singularity represents a point, like the center of a black hole, where rules as we know them seem to break down. In the context of AI, the singularity represents a point where an ASI is not only smarter than humans, but also capable of continually improving itself at a rate far beyond human capability. This self-improvement could potentially cause an explosive acceleration in technological advancement. The singularity is often associated with dramatic predictions, such as the end of humanity, the ability to upload human consciousness into a computer, and the potential for massive societal disruption. It's important to note that the concept of the singularity is highly speculative and controversial. While some experts regard it as a real possibility, others see it as science fiction, we simply can't imagine what a true ASI will be like. So, regardless of where one stands on the possibility of the singularity, the journey through these seven stages of AI helps us to understand the incredible potential of this technology and the challenges and ethical questions it raises. As we look to the future, one thing is certain. 
the role of AI in our world will only continue to grow. This video took a lot of time and effort to create. If you found it helpful and want more content like this, hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. If you have made it this far, comment down below with the word 100% to confirm that you have received the knowledge from this video. For more interesting topics, make sure you watch the recommended video that you see on the screen right now. Thanks for watching.